Welcome back, Ellipses Guns fans, and I'll tell you what, uh, you know, I don't even know where to start with this one. This one's uh, out of the box, and we'll get to out of the box here in just a second, but I'm walking through the sales floor the other day, and uh, as is custom, there are, uh, we, we got some cool guns. I don't want to say laying around the office, but guns that come in that we kind of put on display, uh, you know, for the salespeople and for everyone to kind of see and touch, and uh, walking by Jason's desk, Something caught my eye. Number one, this black Pulp Fiction box right here, and there's something <laughs> equally as magical inside we're going to get to. I, I sort of stopped and paused, and I'm like, what is this? This is, this is clearly not normal. He's like, this is not a normal Ruger box. There's got to be something cool. And whatever's in it, the world needs to know about. Yeah, yeah I knew that right away. So, uh, so Jason, uh, I'm, I'll just flip it right over to you. What, uh, what are we looking at here? Well, Rob, we're looking at uh, the Ruger RSSE project. And this is a project that we worked with Bobby Tyler at Tyler Gunworks. You know, Tyler Gunworks has done a, a lot of projects for us, some custom number ones, some, some other, um, some single action stuff. Bobby does a great job with color casing. His finished work is beautiful, fantastic. Beautiful, beautiful work, yeah. And he approached us about a year ago and said, look, you know, the, the Ruger RSSEs are the, the holy grail of collectibles from Ruger single actions. And, and those are basically were Ruger single six engraved guns. Th those guns were done in, in the late 50s. Bill Ruger had them commissioned. There was only 238 of them made. Um, he, he commissioned a, an engraver named Charles Jarrett to, to do the engraving on these guns. And now they're just worth you know 10,000 plus if they come with the box and everything. And so what Bobby wanted to do, uh, do is, is basically recreate that gun the best he could and uh, and give you know the modern collector something to 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 enjoy. We'll do we'll do the great reveal here while we're talking because I can't stand it anymore. So, <laughs> yeah. but you can keep talking. But uh, uh, and we're gonna get a close up so everybody can see. But we'll uh, we'll pull this out. First yeah. of all, it's a really cool, authentic, you know, uh, correct he, replicate case. He actually went and recreated the the original box as well, and and no no cost was ex was spared for it. I mean. He actually go. He had to go overseas to Sweden to get the the latches for this. This is actually Bible book binding uh, leather cover. That is what the originals were done. The originals had the green the green felt interior, and this is how they were oriented in the gun, in and, the box. And, yeah, yeah. And the fit as you can kind of see yeah, here. And again, really we'll get cool. close ups, you know. But uh, yeah. So that was that, and then you know the guns themselves were five and a half inch um, single sixes. Uh, the, the original old models, which these, the, you know, the original guns were three screw guns because it's pre-1972. So those guns actually had a dovetailed rear sight instead of the fixed sight. Ruger doesn't make that anymore, so we had to take a couple of some, slight some liberties yeah. to, uh, of what we could do. So obviously it's not a three screw gun, it's a new model. It's got the fixed sights. The original RSSEs had aluminum grip frames, but they were polished out silver. Uh, Today's trying to do that, polishing out those grip frames, you can get some, yeah, it's not always comes out that great. So what we decided to do is to do a stainless steel grip frame. So it's a stainless steel grip frame fitted to a blued mainframe and barrel. And the, the wood, I mean, just it's, well, again, you can see in the close-ups, you know, but the, even just seeing it really up close and holding it, the, the quality of the wood, the, the craftsmanship is shocking. Bobby really, shocking. He, did, he, he didn't spare any expense on the details. These are all hand engraved. These are not machine engraved. These are done by hand. Uh, I believe Rocky Sharp did this gun, uh, and it's it's absolutely gorgeous. Uh, it's not an exact copy of the Jarrett pattern because we wouldn't want he wouldn't want to you know knock it off exactly. Right. But it's but it's a it's a nice homage to it. Um, these grips were all hand fitted by Scott Kohler from SK Grips. This is high grade French walnut. I mean, there's no lines, there's no overfitting, there's no shortages anywhere on these grips. They're absolutely gorgeous. It's tight. It's got the old original style uh, medallions like the old models had. One really a feature that is really a knockout, you know, the original guns were flat gates. A lot of people don't know that the original single sixes did not have the rounded loading gate like they do now. They were actually flat. And there's a little thumbnail in there to relieve it. So Bobby recreated that as well. So it's, it's really cool. Uh, to do this, we got Ruger you know, obviously involved, and they did the serial numbers RSSE 1 through 250. And Bobby is basically doing a hundred of these engraved packages like this, and they're all they're available through Tyler Gunworks. I know he's got a lot of them pre-sold, but I do believe there's still a few of them available. So if you want to get one of these, you need to contact Tyler Gunworks and get it, because these are not going to last. But we also had an extra 150 guns on top of the hundred he had to do something with. 
And so Bobby and I kicked it back around and we decided, you know, not everybody is going to be able to afford this package. So let's do maybe a, a grade one, so to say, uh, of this gun. So what we're going to have as Ellipses exclusive is 150 of the RSSE guns that are not engraved. So they're not going to be engraved. They have, uh, Scott Kohler did the grips on these as well. Now it's, it's not quite the same high grade right. walnut as, as the engraved gun, but it's absolutely beautiful and it's, they're all hand fitted. There's no seams here. This is actually the one that I pulled out first. Yeah. And I was like, boy, this thing is beautiful. <laughs> and he's like, oh, oh wait. And then he <laughs> yeah, said, yeah. You know, it gets so, better. So I was really impressed with, right. you, you know, this version, our version, our exclusive of this. Yeah. And then of course, you know, we've got a true masterpiece here, but I mean, it's uh, it's a nice looking, nice looking it's it's a nice revolver. Yeah. They, he case hardened the hammer and the trigger. You know, the, they did the old style grips. And these are going to be serial numbered RSSE 101 through 250. So these are going to be available soon. We should be taking delivery of them you know, any day now. But these will be available. They'll not have the box, uh, but they'll also be about a third of the price. Yeah. So th these will be available. It's still a great collectible. It's a cool project. You know, you say, well, yeah, it's only 150 guns. Why are you interested? This is stuff that's cool, guys. Yeah. You know, I mean, in the days, you know, I, I think everybody's kind of overloaded with different Cerakotes and dips and everything else. This is cool. You know, this is stuff really cool. that, that's, you know, heirloom quality guns that you can pass down, you can enjoy. They're collectible. They're going to go up in value. And uh, it's stuff that, that makes it makes it makes these things kind of fun. We've even got like the certificate. Now this is for the Tyler guns. I've, yes. I've, yeah. So the uh, certificate of authenticity that comes with this, and it's marked uh, obviously, you know, of a hundred. This is number eleven, I think, of a hundred. But uh, so you get this in the box, and and this through Tyler, and this through Lipsy's right here. So uh, this is uh, this is this is a cool new addition. And uh, if you want to check out uh, more of our exclusives, go to LipsiesGuns.com and, and you can hit us up there as far as uh, any information and, and we can get you to the right place for, for these as well. So uh, until next time, aim higher.